Wright State University has a number of diversity initiatives. Our oldest uh, cultural center, for example, is the Belinga Black Cultural Center, which started in the 70s, um, you know, during a time in this country's history when many universities were evaluating um, the climate on campus, the curriculum, and trying to be more inclusive. We had the Women's Center, the Asian and Native American Center, we even have a Latino Affairs um, office on campus. Most recently, we started the LGBT TQ um, Affairs Center on campus. Specifically, our vision says that we want to be known and admired for our inclusive culture that respects um, the diversity of faculty, staff, um, students, and alumni that we have as part of our community. And so it is really part of the fabric of the organization. We've um, begun a policy of, you know, training in terms of our um, search committees, for example, so that people can be aware of implicit bias and take steps to avoid that and try to widen the um, opportunities for people to be part of that pool so that we have more diverse pools and then we, we are, um, you know, better at making sure that those unconscious biases don't impact how we select people. Relatively speaking, we're an affordable institution and we're an institution who meets students where they are. Being actively engaged, being ex an example, um, and being authentic in the extent to which you embrace diversity is something that leaders can do. I think there, you can't say enough about the power of the bully pulpit in terms of leadership and um, the role that they play in modeling. Um, diversity and inclusion and cultural competence. Organizations like NCCJ serve the foundation for what I hope to um, live in in terms of a just society. They provide uh, resources, I think they provide an example of um, how organizations and communities um, can work together across our differences to meet everyone's needs. Thank um, NCCJ and the Dayton um, Chamber of Commerce for or, you know, recognizing the efforts that we've made. And, and our work is certainly aspirational, but it's great to be acknowledged along the way um, to achieving our vision.